Who's this? Ah, it's you. Found my treasure, did you? Junk. I give you more credit than that. Those are my treasures. They're priceless treasures. The flagons are from the finest inns throughout Nern. The bones come from a giant fish that once swallowed my ship. And the meat's from an ancient white mammoth I caught and killed barehanded. Priceless, I say. Ah, and don't get any ideas about snagging a piece for yourself. It's tasty and fermented, but it's all mine. The elves can have the bones. I hate to part with them, but I suppose I'll have to let them go. That skeever won't get any more from me. A deal's a deal. He never asked what the treasure was, did he? It's not my fault he might have expected gold, is it? Ha! <laughs> Where's my share of the treasure? We need to head out before the tide turns again. What? We've been putting on this charade for a pile of bones? Is that all he has? This is a disaster. I should have just killed him and taken what we could scrounge from his corpse. Tell the captain he can keep his bones and rot on this forsaken island. Terms have changed. No treasure, no transport. Unless you have something to sweeten the deal, I'll find a better mark. I hadn't considered that. You can really sniff out gems from a dunghill. All right, I'll take Kamo to Anvil. He proves his worth on arrival, or he's fish bait. Never thought I'd ferry the great Captain Kamo. I've got to admire his moxie. I'll keep my end of the bargain. Now leave me to it before I change my mind. What news? Did that scuttlefish bite? Good news, good news indeed. I was feeling a bit parched on this beach. Ales run dry, you see. I was slew of hard-working lads I mentored back in Anvil, and many of the contact who might help Daros. My thanks for your service.
My friend, it is good to see you all here. I keep hearing reports out of the marsh. Hallow this and the hallow be that. Even on the fringes of the dominion. Yes, I know. Her sister told us a tale of bravery and sacrifice. She said you played an important role, as you so often do. I wish we could offer you a chance to rest and recover. But rest will have to wait for another day. I'm sorry to ask for your service so soon. But after the loss of the champion at Moonmont, your valor could make the difference today. We were on our way to see the champion walk the Two Moons path. Then our advance team began to report. Smoke over Dune, the cries of Daedra, and Stonefire cultists in the streets. Javad Than has grown tired of waiting, it would seem. She and a few of our bravest warriors have gone ahead into the city. They're trying to stem the tide of Daedra, ease up the pressure on our troops here. If you will, Hallowed, I'm sure she'd appreciate the help. Clear the city, end the Daedric threat, and we can meet at the temple. We can usher in a new era of unity in the Salvador Dominion. So formal. Of course, of course. What would you like to discuss? Yes, I have. She's quite the boisterous woman. Seems very capable. But stars above does she know tactics. We had the most fascinating discussion about the most recent push in Cyrodiil. My friend, I know you've chosen well. The Lunar clergy seems to think so, and I find her quite charming. The Khajiiti people are wise and brave in equal amounts. They will grow to love her, I know. According to reports I've been getting, no. They're still trying to hold the few places in the northern woods they've managed to capture, but we pushed them back. Arenthia was their largest victory, and you denied them that. I'm still receiving reports of conflict at a ruin called Samanana. Why the Colobians are so keen to hold an alien ruin in the middle of the wood, Oriel and the most. Those people are beyond. Right, Mons, it's good to see you. This mage here has an idea of how to deal with this poor Deidre. Damn Deidre are everywhere. I saved the son from being an ice sculpture, and in return, he's proposed a bold plan. I think it might even get us out of this alive. When he saw the Deidre, the son raided a vault at the temple, kid after my own heart. He stole a fang relic and did something with it. Something magic. We can use it to seal the portals. I'm sure the priests wouldn't approve, but they're not here. Well, the fang's a little rusty. It sat in the dust for years. His son's magic has tuned it, shaped it, so that it can gather power from the Atranux. We can repower the fang. The old-fashioned way, with claw and blade and spell. And the Atronox while you hold the Fang, and their essence will be transferred into the relic. Once it's primed, it should be simple to seal the portal. You're brilliant, Hallowed. You have the smarts to see this through. You always have before. She's a love that about you. You're almost as wise as she was. I'm fine. I'm Almost glad she isn't here. Mons knows she didn't like all this fighting. She would have hated walking into another city ablaze. All this death in the streets. Almost. Red Thar seemed pretty well certain she'd have to stay down there. Holding that darkness down, keeping it away from the light. I'd love to get her out there someday, though. Maybe if I walk the path. If I'm the main. Maybe. Tharn, you can be sure of that. It wasn't enough that he inflicted the Dark Mane on Akus Ri, or duped the Colovians to assault Arenthia. Now, he tries to shatter the jewel in the desert. Our great city of Dune.
sharp claws on you. All the Atronachs are gone. His son went to investigate the second portal near the mage's guild hall. He might have gone to talk to the other robe and book types. They're over in the merchant district, my friend. I'd like you to see if you can find him. I wish. No, the Thalmor Council wants me to report in. The Queen and Speaker Garishri want to know what's happening on the ground. Kali has your back, Halot. Keep your claws sharp, my friend, and go carefully. This invasion smacks of desperation. Until now, Tharn has stayed to the shadows to openly invade Dune. He must have a plan. If corrupted the leaders of our horde, they ran for the inn. They must plan their escape. The totem. Bea has a working totem. Used it to seal the hole. Always, always said it was protection magic. But the mages, they're trapped in the hole. Kill Bea and destroy the totem. Save the mages and this city.
Hold, mages. This is no Daedra. How did you get through the barrier? Speak quickly, stranger. We're all on edge. Ha! Thank the Eight. I'm glad that witch got the justice they deserved. They sold their souls to Java Tharn, that coward. I can't believe they locked us in here. You've seen... What? Esan dead? And the leaders of our whole corrupted? I can't believe this. That dull-clawed bastard Don. I would rip his throat out with my teeth were he here right now. Yes. We received word that Daedra were attacking the temple district. There must be another portal there. Go, Hallowed. This guild will guard this district from any further Daedric attack. I take it you've restored order to the merchant's district. You do have sharp claws. I have the lads hanging back. I don't think the priests would like mass bloodshed on temple grounds. We should make the tiles run red, though. They've defiled the shrines. Dark heart and bastards. I don't see a portal, so... I have to trust my instincts. Let's cleanse the shrines and let the bright moons shine down on this place. You see to the temples of John and Joel. The old shrine to Lord Kaj still stands. I'll take care of that one. Struggles and twists like a bug in amber. We cannot stop the inevitable. The city is ours. Soon I will hold your mane in my hand, and my dark mane will walk the path. The soul of the Khajiit will be lost to darkness. Cannot overcome the master's mace.
coward. You saved my life. Your claws get sharper every day. Ah, uh, I'll be fine, Halod. That was some damned impressive work. Shaza would, I'm sure, say something about how momentous your actions have been today. I'm just glad I have a friend by my side, especially for what must come next. We pushed back the Daedra. You heard Tharn. He means to walk the two moons path himself. I can't... I can't put this off any longer. We need to make for the Temple of the Dance. Follow me. I'll lead the way. You would have been proud of our friends. Taking on that giant storm at Trenarch without my help? Aunt. Uncle. You're alive. I'm overjoyed. I tried looking pale. We're proud to say we could help you during the invasion. Good luck on your path. <laughs> 